Yo, dudes and dudettes, Die Harvesting here, and I am back to Pokemon Dawn. And uh, yeah, so last part, it was quite a long part that I recorded before. Uh, 40 minutes, pretty much, of like footage. Uh, but yeah, I think that like, it was a pretty decent video to show off like the um, introduction of the game itself and what the story is about. Um, for anyone who hasn't actually watched it, I advise you to watch that and maybe the Pokemon Dusk series that I've done because they all tie into the same storyline. Uh, but yeah, basically it's the zombie apocalypse in the Pokemon world of Generation 2, which is silver, gold, and uh, crystal. And uh, our main character of this game is uh, Drake, or AKA, um, well, silver from like the main story. Uh, so yeah. Uh, pretty cool. We got ourselves a talk dial, and um, I can't remember what we were doing before, so uh, let's uh, talk to the guy again. So, about the food supplies. I don't actually know where we can find some food, but I have some. I got two day ideas, you know. Uh, so, the Pokemart could have some stuff we could eat, or there's always the uh, SSN ship, you know, aka the death ship, as, uh, as Drake said himself. Huh? I, mean, I was, I was, I gave him a Shadow the Hedgehog voiceover. So, uh, <coughs> so SSN, did you become full retard? Did you think that I really want to go back to that ship? You have seen what's going on there. Yeah, this guy is completely triggered over that ship. I have no idea why he's like this, man. <laughs> okay, Pokemon Mart, there it is, man. You know, there's no other possibility. Especially if you're being a little bitch about it, but you know, I'm just saying, Drake. <laughs> Listen, the Pokemon usually sell some Pokemon trainer stuff. But sometimes they sell some snacks for the Pokemon trainers. Really? Really? Bruh. I, I, every time I went there, you know, they only sell you like shit like fucking X. Not even X attacks, man, but you know. Uh, just Pokemon stuff, man. <laughs> oh boy. They have some good tasty bars there. Hey, you got some Snickers? It's got some Twix, man. Whatever. It's only the thing that we could try. Uh, sorry, it's the only thing that we could try, you know? Hmm, alright then. You got a key or something for the Pokemon? Uh, unfortunately, no. Uh, why should I have a Mart key to begin with? <sighs> no problem. I'll just crush the window of the Pokemon and break in. Yeah, he's, he's known for his breaking shit, man. Pokemon usually have weak windows. This guy knows about it, apparently. <laughs> yeah, how do you how do you know that? Uh, never mind. It's it's none of your, nothing of your business. Trust me, trust me. <laughs> hey, I'm going to risk my ass for this again. I'll take a look. I'll be right back. All right, so leave it to Drake to be the thief, man. All right, uh, Lucas. Uh, hi, Drake. Uh, hello. I, I know that you got a lot of things to do, uh, and that you are very busy, but there is something that's spinning in my mind the whole time. Hmm? Okay. Keep thinking about it, because I ain't doing shit. <laughs> got a lot of work to do, so see ya. Uh, s stop Please. Uh, what now? Please, listen. It, it could be worth it, trust me. I'm all ears. I'll, I'll let my Persian out of the house this morning before this disaster happened. But I haven't seen it again since this disease was spread out. I don't know. I mean, my Persian can take care of itself, but I'm still worried about it. I think it, do it doesn't know that I'm not at home anymore. It will be fine. Uh, Drake, please. <sighs> What do you expect from me? That I'm looking for a damn cat that ran off? Hey, at l at least at last it is my Pokemon. Oh, at last, at least it is my Pokemon. Listen, the effort is going to be worth it. My Persian has something in its collar which could be useful to you, and it could also attack other zombies, not just my fucking Tortoise. Aha! If you find my Persian, I could give you this useful thing to you, you know. So please, find my Persian, please. I don't have time for that shit. <laughs> All right, fine, I'll, I'll, I'll do it. All right, if it's really worthwhile, where is that brute? 
Oh, you're doing it? Really? <laughs> this dude is like, this guy is actually fucking doing it. All right, cool. Thanks. Thank you, man. My person usually plays around Route 6. Look, if it's there. Thanks, Drake. Really, I'm so grateful. Yeah, yeah. I'll take a look by a chance. All right, so uh, Mr. Drake here is actually a good guy. <laughs> He's all he's all cindery, but uh, when he gets asked for like something, he's like, okay, fine, I'll do it. <laughs> and this is Mr. Christopher. I'm giving him like a really geeky voice. And so, what about the medical supplies, I can heal you to the dial, no problem. But still, I need some medical supplies, and I don't have any here, not in my house. But the Poker Center recently received some medical supplies. The the Pokemon Center. What do you think happened to it? Oh, uh, I don't know, man. I, I really don't want to think about what might have happened. I don't think that the Pokemon Center is well protected against the uh, apocalypse, you know? But uh, if you, if the Pokemon Center is still fine, then you could ask a Nurse Joy for some medical supplies. If she's even fucking alive. <laughs> hey, I have an idea. Nurse Joy could join us. All right, that would be great, man. That would be great. Uh, just get Brock as well. Uh, we got uh, an A team, right? 18. <laughs> she is much better in handling with the supplies, if you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, 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 you know what? That sounds good to me. Hell yeah. <laughs> what if more survivors are in there? This house is already full. Hmm. Right. Uh, yeah. Uh, then just go in and ask if you could get some supplies. Shouldn't be a problem, though. So, would you go get us some supplies? No, I gotta think about this. <laughs> All right, fine, I'll do that as well. Yep, I'll, I'll get them. The question is, how do I get in there? That was super. <laughs> really? <laughs> so, I got some key in my house. It's hidden in the bookshelf. You can open the poker center with that house. Uh, with that house, with that key. <laughs> how the hell do these people even have their, these keys inside the houses, man? That's what I want to know. Fortunately, the center management gave me that. Oh, of course, there's always an explanation for that center a while ago. Understood, but that doesn't really make sense, but okay, fine. I'll go with whatever you say. I'll be right back. All right, Total Dial, we got some missions to do, as per usual. So, uh, yeah, let's get right into this fucking ordeal, shall we? Uh, what was the attack moves again? All right, so A is the attack button, and S is for the water gun attack. Um, so if I remember, his house was over here, was it? Uh, I think so. I can't remember like, whose house it was. The key must be in here. Got it. Hey, I found it. Let's see what's going on in the Pokemon Center. Better be some good shit. Some drugs as well. Was well, someone trying to attack me already? <laughs> Alright, let's go in and see the Poke Center. Yeah, water gun it. Good job, Totodile. Door unlocked. Discarded the key. I bet there's zombies in there. Yep, I fucking... Let's get... What? I fucking knew it. <laughs> <sighs> Seems like nobody survived that assault. God damn it, Brock is gonna be pissed, man. Who's he gonna flirt with now? Ah, <laughs> oh, man, that sucks. Got old man Jenkins here. We can't even heal our Pokemon. Actually, you just get fucking Christopher to heal our Pokemon here. I mean, we got the Pokemon, um, I mean the Pokemon, the, uh, the Poke Center machine here, so you might as well use it. Is there anything up here? Any more Zom Zoms? No? Nothing. Hey, look, we can go into it. There, there we go. Medical supplies. I knew it. So this is what they've been hiding in here. There is some exchange symbol and a sign. No use for us. Um, dude, you're 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 a Pokemon trainer. You should know what that is. It's a trading Pokemon. All right. So at least we got some medical supplies. Ain't too shabby. Can we go on the internet around here? A center PC. Even if it was on, it wouldn't be useful because I don't know. I don't have any other Pokemon. And this is why you get more Pokemon. It's fucking scrub, man. Seriously. Alright, there we go. Locked. I wonder what kind of machine this is. Dude, it's... Uh, did Bill not tell you anything? Oh, yeah, I, I forgot. You're just a fucking... Uh, you're, you're basically a robber, man. <laughs> this guy doesn't know shit. Versus. Probably still a bad room for Pokemon trainers. At least you got that right, dude. But, yeah, that machine is uh, to go back in time. Which I think was really cool. Huh? Stop! Uh, please, wait. Huh? Hey, I don't trust that shit. Oh, shit. Please, <coughs> help me. 
It hurts. It hurts so much. Dude, just, just put him out of his misery. He, he ain't going to survive. Trust. There. In this medical box. There are some painkillers. Give me this medical supply box. Hmm. No, or I'll give you one. See, this is the thing, though. Even if you were to give him a medical supply box, he's not going to survive. That's the thing. Even if I want to go as a, um, I don't know, a good a good guy right on this, I highly doubt this is going to end well. Because we're going to waste our supply, and this guy's going to turn a zombie on us. So, no. I mean, we can always just increase our fucking um, the bar any, anyway. I hope so. Uh, but yeah, nah, I'm not gonna give him a shit, man. Hey, nothing personal, but you won't survive under this condition. We need this medical supply more than you. <laughs> Shadow going evil on us. Eh, bastard. <laughs> and now we kill him. Oh shit, that really went us down to a fucking negative. Well, shit, I'm just gonna step on his corpse just to, you know... <laughs> Just to inflict the negativity a bit more. <laughs> but dude, he wasn't going to survive anyway, man. What was the point? I ain't going to, like, give away medical supplies to a guy who's pretty much dead. There's no point, man. Oh, <laughs> is he already back? Yeah, seems like I am, hmm? Dumbass. H have you been successful? Yeah. So, uh, how's it looking in the Pokemon Center? Is, is everyone safe there? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> nah, the, the people in the Pokemon Center, they weren't prepared. The infected overran it. Oh my god, Th this can't be true. Uh, is everyone... Dude, how dumb are you? <laughs> the guy literally told you. The infected fucking took over. So is everyone dead? You don't say. You don't say. I'm not even going to reply to it. He's like, here, just, 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 just get the supplies. Okay. Alright, Christopher, the medical supplies, free medical supplies, great. Uh, I can heal your toilet up to three times now. Come back to me if you need my help. Alright, I don't think I need to heal up my team just yet. Or maybe I might need to... Actually, no, I can probably survive. Nah, fuck it. What I will do is save. Alright, so mission one is complete. Now, on to mission two, route six. Uh, need to look for that Persian. Uh, I have no idea where the hell it might be. It must be over here. Route 11. Oh, okay, it's definitely not here then. Um, route 6 must be up top. What was the other mission that we had to do? I have no idea. I, ca I can't remember now. Alright, we got this motherfucker. Come here. Get over here. Alright, come on, man. I know you're, you're a zombie, man. So you're supposed to be dumb as hell. But don't do no damn tactics to me, man. You're supposed to be stupid. There we go. Done. He's dead. He dead. Alright, so this should be Route 6. I'm not sure. Wait, I got some trails here. What's going on over here, I wonder? The footprints in here. Was that... Was was that Persian here? Did it go somewhere else? Most probably did, but by the judging of it, uh, it looks like uh, I might have got infected because, um... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, there's nowhere else that we can go to, to be honest. Uh, so, yeah. That Persian looks like it must have got inflicted some damage. So, yeah. that, that uh, There's more footprints just randomly appearing. Again. Hmm. I still can't see that Persian. Where is it? Where is she? <laughs> Where is that Persian? Alright. Maybe he went over here. What the hell was that? I thought I saw something, but yeah, we got a fucking bell sprout. Bell sprout. Bell sprout. Yeah, good job, man. This guy is actually trying to duke me out. Holy crap, do you see that? He, like, blo the, the dude fucking, like, uh, <laughs> dodged my moves, like, twice. Alright, there's gotta be something. Still don't trust this guy. Alright, uh, okay, there we go. And another one. This cat is kidding me. <laughs> Where is this goddamn little beast? Dude, I have no idea, man. Must be around here somewhere. Honestly, if it's like bleeding out like this, I'm pretty sure it's good for dead, man. It's, it's done for. Oh, look, it's gonna go into SSN. 
Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, it's dead. It, it's, it's, it's donezo, man. Hey, there it is. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I like how I could use my move, but it, it just went in straight into a comment. I see. When it was playing around, it was likely being attacked from the infected. It frequently tried to find another hideout after the assault, but it didn't make it. It has been infected. Careful. It's attacking us. Uh, you, you don't say. Alright, sorry, dude. Um, unfortunately, your your person has got to die, man. What the fuck? He just, he just did a fucking hot move or something. Is it, like, dashing? Yeah, it's dashing. Holy crap. Yeah, let's, let's just get out of here. Get some distance between us. Because I ain't risking it. Come on, then. Come over here. Dude, it's fucking, like, sturdy as shit, man. Holy crap. How many hits can it take? Oh. Hey, I got it. At least we got the collar. That was the main thing that we wanted. All right, let's bring the collar back to Lucas. Sorry, dude. Poor Persian, man. Hey, at least Meow from Team Rocket will be happy. Guy wanted him dead for a long time. <laughs> All right. Uh, sorry, man. Got some bad news. You you didn't find my f Persian, did you? Yeah, I found it, but it didn't survive. W w what did you say? My cute Persian dead? That that must be a mistake. Nah, sorry, man. Aw. <laughs> wow. Way to be an insensitive motherfucker. Don't fucking cry. Stop being a pussy. Alright, I'm just gonna be a good guy, man. I'm trying to get that fucking good bar going, man. Listen, Lucas. Don't drag yourself down now. Think about your friends. We all want to come through this bad situation. You understand, right? Here. I took the Persian locker. I mean, Persian locker? Persian collar. <laughs> Drake gives Lucas the collar. Persian. I had it since it was a little meowth. But you're right. I shouldn't think about it for now. Here. Have this. It was in the collar. Hey, that's actually really dandy, man. I think I need some time alone. Alright, dude. Sorry, bro. Uh, Alright, so what we could do is uh, maybe we could take that pack and uh, use it. Yeah, because... Ah, uh, oh, there we go. Back to 10. Back to 20 in this case. Can we talk to him? Hey, Drake. I hope everything is soon over. I just want to go home. I know, man. It's a, it's a peak situation, man. Not going to lie. Alright, so the Pokemon... Alright, cool. Uh, let's go into the Pokemon, then. Save me game. Because <laughs> I'm a... Uh, I'm a crazy saver, man. I like saving my shit all the time. Locked. I should smash the window from the opposite side of the house. Like over here? Oh, over here? Oh, over here? Do I have to hit it? No? Maybe this? Oh, okay. There we go. Hey, Croc. Your part. Break the window. Uh, he's getting crocked to be in the fucking criminal side as well, man. <laughs> Break that shit. <laughs> he's like... <laughs> fucking fat bastard. Fat bastard. Alright, there we go. We killed some motherfuckers. Probably ate all the food here, man. Alright, let's take something. Hmm. Seems like this place is empty. Everything is gone. <laughs> Except this one. Oh, wait, wait, a, a sentry? Hey, wait a minute, that's a live sentry. Hey, yo, what? The guy just stole us fucking shit. What the? <laughs> a sentry? It, it wasn't affected. You don't say, but it, it fucking took your shit. Quick, let's follow it. Uh, is there nothing else I can take, though? No, nothing? What an asshole, man. That guy just came in and just took our shit. <laughs> wow, man. Can we open it from here? All right, here we go. Now we can unlock it. Yo, come back here, man. After it. That is so annoying. Fucking, fucking centrits, man, taking our shit. Yo, man, I ain't got no time to deal with your bullshit, man. Where the hell did these zombies come from? We killed everything already. 
Oh, I see. You're trying to loot me, yeah? Come. Come then. Oh. There we go. Kill one guy. This is the thing, though. When you're killing these mo these, these zombies, man, you just have to... You, just, uh, you have to, like, uh, get yourself a good distance from each other. So you can, like, actually hit them. Oh, oh, I see how you did. What? This guy is, like, fucking dodging all my moves, man. This guy is pro. Damn! My water gun, like, cut him in half. That's how shit Rattata is, man. Fucking Rattata is. Fuck, fuck your, uh, your top percentage Rattata, man. That's, that's, that's the fucking, like, uh, I don't know, conspiracy, man. <laughs> what the hell? You see that dude, like, walking fast? What the fuck? I don't remember a zombie walking that fast. Jesus Christ. Is this one of those, like, zombie films where, like, the... Wait a minute, that's me! Holy shit, I didn't even realize! How come I was just there, like, chilling with the zombie? <laughs> and the zombie didn't even attack me. That was all weird, man. Seems like the sentry has a hideout here. Hmm, let's head in. Fucking sentries, man. Yo, give me back my shit, man. What are you doing? Oh, it's got a whole family. We should capture these guys and, like, make it work for us, man. Hmm... Seems like the Centric took the berry to feed its family. It is just a berry, but... Nah, you know what? I mean... I know I'm trying to get the good route here, so that's obviously part, part of the reason why I'm gonna do the good thing about this, but... Like, honestly, we have three medical things that we could use. And Totodile is pretty much at full health. As long as we're careful about taking damage, we sh it shouldn't be a problem. So what we'll do is we'll leave it. Let the sentry. I mean, a berry. What's a berry gonna do for like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight? Like eight sentries. That's not gonna feed a family, man. So yeah, fuck it. They can keep it. It's just a berry. We don't need it that much. Come, let's leave them alone. Like I said, dude, you, you should just like I don't know, maybe get a pokeballs and take them. So, the search for the food supplies didn't work as expected. Hmm. Let's go back for now. Alright, so, uh... <sighs> two missions without any... Any successful, um... I don't know, outcomes, really, in this case. I mean, this dude's Persian is dead. And, um, yeah, that berry's long gone, man. Sorry, man. So, have you been successful? Nope. No food supplies there. Nothing at all. Ah, Fuck. That means there is nothing left, man. Like, th the whole city is empty. What now? Hmm. Hey, I, I know exactly what you're thinking about. The SSN. Yeah, I, I said, I told this, man. I told these dudes before. SSN, man. It's the only way. Please listen, Drake. Before you say something, the most of the infected went off the ship when the people ran out of it. That doesn't make it any better. Stop being a pussy, Dre. I thought you were supposed to be this edgy fucking hard-on dude. And now you're like, uh, I I'm not going to ship. I ain't going into death ship. Yeah, but consider this. What if we wait here for a few days without food? If this is all over, then you and your Pokemon would be too, too weak to keep on moving on. Unfortunately true. <sighs> you know what? That shit full of the undead... Seems like I don't have much of a choice. I gotta go back to that horse ship. So, you're you're really doing it? Yeah, but but still, I'm doing that for me. This dude is like, I'm not doing it for you, man. It's fucking Sundaray, man. <laughs> mm, okay, uh, oh, okay, fine. All right, enough for me. You know, just just do it, man. Just do it. About, about the ship, though. Um, I had some I had some lunch break in the ship's kitchen. They did uh, they did some tasty meals. They did have some tasty meal, you mean? Uh, yeah, uh, I expected this anyway. I paid 5,000 polka dollars for that luxury. Damn. Whatever. <laughs> uh, the kitchen of the SSN should be full of food supplies. I think that should be good for a while. Yeah, as long as they're not rotten. Uh, the kitchen, huh? Hmm, the SSN. That could actually work. Alright then. I'll give it... I'll get... I'll go, Jesus Christ. Can't tell, I'll get the supplies. But... This is the last time I risk my life for you. I, I, I'm sorry, dude, but you said that you're doing this for yourself, and now you're saying I'm not. I'm doing this for you for the last time. Okay, this, this guy doesn't ha know what you're saying, man. 
Yeah, okay. <laughs> Even Simon's like, this dude, man, he's got mental issues. Good luck, Drake. All right, Drake. Stop being a little wuss, man. Stop being a little edgy, Lord. And let's just go into it, man. This is what I was saying before in the last episode. I was like, yo, you know what? You know what we should do? Just barge into the ship. Kill all the zombies there. And then just... Hey, look, it's, it's the fucking... It's that fucking truck. You know, like the conspiracy about Mew. That you can get a Mew in there. Yeah, it's, it's there. <laughs> I like how he, the, the, the guy who made this mod uh, left that as an Easter egg. That's really cool. Hey, 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 hey. I wasn't ready. Hey, yo. Die. I like the music in this, though. Oof. Very ominous. Very evil sounding, man. Yo, how come that attack went through them? Yo, this song could have... This song is pretty deep. Like, it's pretty sick, man. Hey, yo, 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 yo. Calm the hell down, man. As I was saying, this music is pretty cool, man. It's pretty dope. I mean... Could definitely pass off as a Nintendo Core song, man. <laughs> oh yeah, I love that fucking, fucking like uh, Agrippedos. <laughs> nice. Whoever made this tune, man. Nice. Poke Gear song two out of six unlocked. Obtained. Juggler Soldier. Uh, uh, cool stuff, man. Can I play it? This, this music's good, man. Oh, Hey, that's pretty good, man. Aw, oh, man, are you serious? I can't listen to it, like, outside of it? That's one thing that they should have, like, added to this game. That door won't open. It's blocked from the inside. I wonder who the hell blocked themselves in there, man. Hey, look, we got a note. Is this Amnesia? The Dark Descent? Diary of a Passenger, March 18th of 2000. Wow, the SS Anne is such a wonderful ship. <laughs> I'm so excited having my honeymoon with my wife, Rosalind, here. Yeah, that didn't end well, man. <laughs> we will travel to Kanto together. I have waited so long for this. The equipment, the staff, the view, everything is so perfect. The day has just started as the sun is rising, but I'm sure I won't forget this beautiful day. The following entry was written at a later time. Rosalind just came back from a sightseeing tour. She wanted me to be with her, but she knows that how I am into books when I'm on long journeys. Obviously, she doesn't feel so good. She laid down to rest a bit. Oh, crap. Maybe she has some seasickness? That poor thing. She is sweating a lot. I hope she will be fine soon. I think I should call the medical doctor of the ship. The next entry is scrawly. Oh shit, I can't believe what happened. I brought Rosalind to the doctor. She rested there for a few hours. When the doctor visited her again, she suddenly jumped out of bed and bit off two fingers from the doctor. Rosalind, what's wrong with you? I don't know what to say. The rest of the diary is full of blood. Well, shit. <laughs> uh, that escalated quickly, man. So yeah, the guy's wife just fucking went full zombie mode. And I'm guessing he must have died as well. Door won't open. It's blocked from the inside again. Uh, locked. The next sign. Oh, the next sign uh, to the door says kitchen. There should be enough food for us, but we need a key. So I'm guessing the key is probably um, somewhere in the ship. I guess it's the only plausible explanation here. So uh, yeah. All right. I bet there's some enemies to fight. Yep, there is. Get off me. Yo, man, that's some stump you're trying to pull, man. I hate it when they like jump back and then they try and like escape your move, man. Alright, there's nothing here? No? Alright. Alright, he doesn't even want to check the trash. The door went open! Block from the inside again. Uh, nothing here again? Nope. That guy looked like he was alive still. Like, what the hell? <laughs> oh, this dude is dead. Hey, look, we got a safe here. A safe, huh? Hmm, I don't think the owner still needs the content inside. It's locked. I could open it with the right code. Fuck it, fine, though, man. Let's just put 666. Six, six. Would that work? No? 666? Six, six. <laughs> no. Hmm, seems this wasn't the right code. Is there any clues here that I might know of? 
Nothing. Nothing. God damn it. Hey, look, it's a dead Pikachu. Can't get in. The door handle broke. Then why don't you just kick it in? Use your toggle dial to just, you know, smash that shit open. Fucking fat bastard. Come on, get over here. Die. Die. Jesus Christ, man. Alright. <laughs> I can see there's like a body in the like left. <laughs> Drake found the berry. Alright, not too shabby. Trash again. Got his head on the fucking floor. Uh, is there nothing here? Yeah, I'm guessing those zombies are either floating dead or they're actually swimming. <laughs> if they're swimming, then hey, man, you know what? I, I give congrats to you, man. This is an accomplishment in itself. All right, let's uh, let's go upstairs then. Ah, God damn it! I have to always wait for the the power to load up again. Right, I'm starting to run out on power, man. All right, there's nothing here, nothing. No codes, no keys, nothing. God damn it! All right, let's go in here. The door won't open. Blocked from the inside. Again, and there was a Pokemon approaching us, but fuck it. <laughs> Trash. I bet you in one of these bins, there's gonna be like one of the keys. I, 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 I fucking like bet you that it's gonna be the case. What the hell is that? Haha, <laughs> duke, you bitch. Alright, we just like. Yeah, there we go. Some Call of Duty shit, man, right there. <laughs> 360 degree, no scope. Yeah, no, fuck that memes, man. Those memes are dead, man. They're dead. <laughs> All right, let's check this out again. No, just trash again, as always. Wait, was that Eradicate? That looks like Eradicate. Sort of resembles Eradicate. I'm not gonna lie. All right, hey, we got some more stuff here. There are a lot of entries of diaries. Oh wait, there are a lot of entries in this diary. Should I read it? Yep. Di <laughs> Diary of Seamen. <laughs> January 12th, too fast. After a long time of unemployment, I finally managed to get a new job. <laughs> well, I'll be dandy. I'll be a seaman of famous SSN. <laughs> I'm already so excited. I'm happy being part of such a big crew. January 17th of 2000. My first day at my new job. It was a hard day, but that's what I expected. I'm so done. But I have to do the dirty jobs because I'm the new one. But I don't have any problem with that. That's it. I'm going to sleep. I don't have any energy left to write anymore. January 20th, 2000. My fourth day is on the SSN is over. Uh, my co-workers have the opinion that I don't belong to this crew. Wow. What a fucking bosses, man. Jeez. I find, I find this pretty sad. Did I say something wrong? I'm doing the dirty jobs already, like scrubbing the deck. I hope I'll get some better job on the ship. January 28th, 2000. So, it's weekend, but guess who has to stay on the ship for a whole weekend to clean up the storage place? Yep, me, damn it. Time to find a new job, dude. Straight up. <laughs> but it, it, that's fine, that's fine. You know, I'm still new. They will accept me after a while. I hope. February 11th, 2000. Damn. I've been on this ship for almost one month. I'm still unwanted here. Dude, why the fuck are you even there to begin with? I would have left. <laughs> why I think that I'm unwanted? Wait, why I think that I'm unwanted? Well, someone took my work clothing and has thrown them off board. <laughs> wow. Bunch of assholes, man. I begged the captain to give me some new work clothing, but he refused. I feel myself so unwanted here. February 19th, 2000. It doesn't get any better. <laughs> someone stole my wallet today. Great. Bunch of assholes. I'm applying for a new job, yep. I hope I'll find something new. Dude, fuck this ship. You know what? This ship deserved to have gone into like the uh, the zombie apocalypse. It, it deserves it. <laughs> March 6, 2000. My applications came back. Denials only. It's getting worse here. Got to find a way out. My co-workers found out that I'm applying for new jobs. They have beaten me to the ground. Damn. And told me that no one wants a pussy like me after they found out. Someone should shoot those sons of bitches. Hey man, now you you can you can shoot them as much as you want. Now that they're fucking zombies. March tenth, two thousand. The last day were a little better. Uh, the last days were a little better. I avoid my quote unquote 
co-workers as good as I can. I'm working in the storage room very often, but this can't be a permanent condition. I'm always scared they could do something bad to me. March 12, 2000. My co-workers accidentally dropped down my food tray today while we had lunch break. Of course, I didn't get a new one. I got enough. I should do some payback, but how? March 18th, 2000. I'm not writing down these lines because I'm desperate. <laughs> no, some explanation? Here. I was working in the storage room today where a ratata appeared. Nothing unusual, but the ratata looked a little sick. It tried to attack me, but I could dodge it and I killed it with an iron pipe. Damn, this guy is badass, man. And then I had a brilliant idea. I cut the dead. Oh, <laughs> my God. That is like the best fucking payback. This dude legit caused the fucking zombie apocalypse in the fucking shit as payback. Bruh, you know what? I, I, I give congrats to this dude, man. They fucking deserved it. <laughs> I cut the, the rat into little pieces. The food was just prepared in the kitchen. <laughs> and your mouse, have you seen chef? <laughs> and this is a family recipe. The menus for the passengers and the crew are usually split. <laughs> So I went to the kitchen and tossed those radata pieces to the pot of the cruise lunch. Haha, <laughs> you wankers! I hope you enjoy your curry at the AKA Radata or curry a la Ratata. Is it Ratatouille, yeah? Fucking Ratata. <laughs> Go to hell. Wow, even I think this is disgusting. <laughs> but what did he mean when he mentioned that the Radata looked sick? Come on, dude, don't be fucking daft. The, the Radata was obviously a zombie. How the fuck do you expect? That the zombie outbreak happened on a ship. Think about it. Was it infected? Is that the reason why the crew became sick? You don't fucking say. That sick bastard <laughs> is a family recipe, man. You can't blame him. <laughs> uh, that's peak. That is peak. I mean, who would have thought that that shit would have happened to begin with? I mean, granted, that, that was fucked up of him to do that because, you know, putting a dead fucking ratata on like food is a bad idea in itself but if he did it as like payback on those guys then fair enough but he did it on the whole ship that's like peak man come on don't be dickhead ah the captain's cabin it's locked Aye, the captain's cabin alright is there a way to open this ship because there is no way there is no way out now What what do I do Unless if I look up every single fucking, um, I don't know. Oh, oh, wait, no, we haven't gone here. Forgot about that. Hey, look, it's a Whopper. I'm gonna cut you up and put you into a burger, man. Call it the double Whopper. All right, uh, trash. Really? Come on, man, there's gotta be something here. Oh. Die, die, die. There we go. Hey, I found the kitchen key. Not bad. All right, at least we found something. And is there anything here? Trash again? Hey, look, it's Gramps. Hey, Gramps, what's up? <laughs> just an old dude just laying there. Wow, man. This is a peak situation, man. So just because of one dude who, like, fucking trolled his uh, co-workers, this whole fucking situation happened. That is peak, man. <laughs> I wonder what happened to the dude. I bet he fucking got, like, karma, man. Alright, so, uh, there should be some zom zoms in here. Oh, wait a minute. There's one person that's alive. And one zombie. Wait, how the fuck is he still in there? How, what, how is he? That doesn't make sense. So the door was locked. But then they've been here the whole time. What the hell have they been doing? Stop, D don't come any closer. Is it a girl or a guy? Because I'm not sure. Hey, man, I'm serious. Stop that shit. Well, oh, he's dead. He's dead. Whoever it was, he's dead. Bastard! Croc! Attack! <laughs> hey, one shot kill, man. Why don't you do that more often? <sighs> he got you. He got you good. It, it, yeah. Thanks for the help. Uh, it hurts. At least the wound does not bleed so much. Other people were devoured by those psychos. I, I don't know what's wrong with him. I locked us up in the kitchen a few hours ago, and then he become to one of those psychos. I think you've seen what goes on, uh, what what was going on here after. Hmm, he's bitten. Hey, listen. 
I was supposed to come back on the ship to collect some food supplies. Ar aren't you some kind of rescue unit? Oh, man. So, you came back to collect some food supplies? That's insane. Yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> oh, uh, sorry. Uh, over there in that box, it contains some food. Nothing left but this. Really? B by the way, what's your name? Drake. My name's Drake. Oh, okay, thanks, Drake. I, I think you just saved my life. Dude, your, your life is done for, man. My my name is Andre. And what what about Vermilion City? Is everything peaceful there? <laughs> yeah. Nah, nah, nah. nah. It's, it's, it's much worse than the ship, man. Uh, that's why we need supplies to survive for a few days. What the fu- What now? Getting off the ship. I got what I came for. I, I see. Do you have a safe place there? Pretty yes. Um, and... Would it be possible to come with you? Uh, this is a flashback. This disease turns humans and Pokemon into murdering creatures. It is recommended to avoid contact with those infected all the time. It is now known that this infection can be transferred if someone gets bitten by accident. Being bitten even once is already enough. I guess it's gonna be a, uh, uh, yeah, it's gonna be one of those choice things, I think. As long as he won't stay in my way, I'm fine with it. I'll take him with me. Maybe Chris can patch him up. Alright. You know what, you could come with me. But don't even think about to fool or betray me. You get me? Uh, you hear me? <laughs> you get me? <laughs> you get me? You're going to have a bad time if you try, okay? You're going to have a bad time, it's like that meme. Uh, okay, th th thanks, Drake. Dude, uh, I wouldn't really recommend getting this guy on the team, man. Just saying. Let's take the food supplies before we leave. Dude, uh, you can even see his health. Look at that. It's, I bet it's going to deteriorate. And then we're going to just end up, like, seeing him dying and turning into a zombie on us. Like, I'm telling you right now. That's it. We got what we came in for. Trust. This box contains dishes. Useless. Hey, man, we could throw dishes at the zombies, innit? Dishes, so there's nothing there. No food. No, 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 no non zip zana. Okay, there should be some stuff inside the bins. Usually there's like a Pokeball in here. Hey, look, see, I told you, man. Found a berry. Trash. Nothing else. Hey, wait a minute. This guy might actually know about the safe if we take him there. Oh. Is that a fucking Geodude sound effect? What the fuck is this? A Geodude sound effect coming from this guy? It's a bit strange. Oh no, it's a matchup. What the hell was I thinking? Sounded like a, a, a fucking Geodude for some reason. Don't know why I got that. Come on. There we go. <clears throat> Alright, I want to go and check that fucking uh, locker. So it should be around here somewhere. Because maybe this dude... We should bring Andre to the safe house before we examine this place. Can't get in. The door handle broke. The door won't open. It's blocked from the inside. Wait. Oh wait, no, no. We went. We went there already before. I just want to find out about the um. The uh the locker thing, cause maybe this guy might know the code. Maybe. You know, it's it's worth a try. Alright, come on, man. There should be something here. What was it now? No, it wasn't that one. Okay, I think it was the last one here. No. Okay, you know what? Never mind. Uh, can't be asked, to be honest. Maybe he might know about the captain's place? Maybe. Nope. No input from, from Andre. Come on, Andre, man. You're supposed to help us out. <laughs> Even if you're fucking dying on us, but whatever. Don't care. Alright, so it wasn't there. Door went open. And I think I checked this one already, I don't know. Yeah. Okay, so it's definitely not down here. Uh, 
Ah, never mind. No, fuck it, I'm leaving. I'm, I highly doubt that he would have the code, to be honest. Alright, let's get over here. Come on. Oh, what the hell? Wait, we can we can exploit this by hitting him as many times as one. But nah, I'm not gonna do it that way. There we go. Man, that polywag looked fucking evil as shit. It looks one of the girls. Come on in. What the hell? Sometimes the water gun doesn't work. Sometimes it goes right through them. I don't understand why. Alright, let's go over here. Everyone's gonna be like, what the hell? So, here we are. Wow, it seems to be safe here. Hey, everyone! Uh, don't mind me, I'm just infected. <laughs> God damn it. Hey, welcome back, Drake. So, did you find something? Yeah. That food supply... What? That supply box that contains food. I found it on the ship. Here. Alright. Uh, wow. It, it's so great. Seems like I can retire young. <laughs> I won't lift a finger anymore. Uh, of course. <laughs> hey, hey, wait a minute. Whom did you bring with you? Some guy who was locked in the kitchen. His name is Andre. Oh. Uh, okay, uh, no problem. He can stay here. Yeah. Hmm. But there is one problem, though. Huh? Problem? Do you see his injury on his arm? Uh, yeah. I, I see it. Well, an infected bit him. <laughs> Wait. What? <laughs> it's like, dude, and you, you fucking taking him here? Come on, man. Um, infected. What, what are you talking about? Uh, uh, he, he doesn't know. <laughs> uh, no, no, about what? Infected? Uh, this guy who bit you, he was infected. That's why he was so insane. Aha, uh -huh, okay. But what does that mean for me? It means you're dead. You're dead. <laughs> you also get infected. And you will turn into one of them after a while. What? <laughs> and how can I stop this infection? Christopher over there is a paramedic and... Hey, 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 hey. D there is no cure or vaccination at this time. I told you before. <sighs> no, no cure? Is that, a, is that a fucking joke? Come on, you folks are kidding me, right? I, hey, I, man, I, I wish it was a joke, but uh, hey, we, we listened to the Jota broadcast again when Drake was away. And, uh, there is nothing that can stop the infection. Uh, no vaccine, no cure, uh, nothing. And then the radio moderator screamed into the microphone and the connection was cut. Shit went down. Um, after he turns, he will be a threat for us. He could tear us apart like the people in the SSN. Yeah, right, exactly. There is nothing we could do for him, man. Uh, that means we have to get rid of him. What? No. Please, please, just, just let me stay here. I didn't escape from the ship just to die like an animal out there. You can't do this to me. I'm, I'm human. Oh, man. Shit. Drake, wh what do you think? Get rid of Andre. <laughs> I got an idea. Let's hear out what he's got an idea about, man. Because I want to know. Hey, you went I got an odd idea. Hey, how we can help him. Just throw him into the, the zombies' as bait. <laughs> Uh, what kind of idea? This infection is unstoppable, Drake. Just saying, there is nothing we can do. Oh, wait, my, my battery is about to die. <laughs> Alright, there we go. We can... We can cut off in... What? Oh, damn. We're gonna go like straight off like the walking dead on this shit. Uh, okay, we're gonna cut off his, his arm, man. Let's go for it. What? <laughs> Are you insane? He, he depends on you, man. Either we cut off your infected arm, or we'll just throw you out there. Or out of here. <laughs> out there, you get the point. And then you can walk outside as one of those undead. Your decision, bro. S stop. Are you absolutely sure that this is necessary? 
Oh, does it look like we're fucking around here, mate? You seen that guy who turned into the kitchen? Uh, who turned into the kitchen? Jeez, I can't read for shit. You seen that guy who turned in the kitchen? Like I said, this will also happen to you, or we will prevent this quickly. Um, uh, you are absolutely sure about it? Absolutely. Ah. Uh, okay. If there isn't any other chance, then uh, we're doing it. Good. Christopher, can you do an amputation? Uh, sorry, Drake, but <laughs> I'll be honest, man. That, that, that's a bit too heavy for me, you know what I'm saying? I'm a paranoid, but not a butcher. <laughs> I won't ask Nooskus in the first place. And me neither. Can't do such a... Oh, my God. These guys are fucking pussies, man. <sighs> Fine, then I'll do it. This dude has to do everything. How is he gonna do? Is he just gonna get taught now to rip out his arm? <laughs> just pop, taught now. Use crunch. Done. Okay, I disinfected his arm. Andre, are you ready? Any last words? Ah <laughs> uh, man, I won't be able to fat no more. <laughs> Please, just just make it fast, man. Just make it fast. Believe me when I say that. I won't drag this out or enjoy it. Maybe enjoy it a little bit, but fuck it. So, Christopher, give me the introduction. Yeah, uh, right. Um, Andre, uh, putting your arm on the table. All right. Do it already. <laughs> yes. Sorry. O okay. Okay. Okay, good. Uh, Drake, take the saw and then place it slightly over the back wound. Yeah, 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 that, that, look, that looks good. Yeah, Krispy Kreme, man. That, that, that looks good, man. Yeah, so the, the next step is to, is to saw through the flesh and bone. Yeah, alright, put on some Volvodinia. I need some slams to get me through the shit. Dun, 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 dun. dun, dun, dun. <laughs> oh, uh, uh. oh, man, yeah. <laughs> oh, damn. Oh god. <laughs> that was fucked up. Quick, uh, we gotta tie up his open wound, man. Holy shit. Hey, at least we got good points for that. Score some good brownie points. Hey. Hey, that was some bloody matter. Did he survive? Uh, yeah. Andre is sleeping in my bed right now. But I'm not even wondering. He just lost an arm. Either that or he would be six feet under. Yeah, I hope it works. We will catch him. I mean, we will catch him. We will watch him. I was about to say that. We will catch him if he turns into a zombie. Regarding the we, I'm done with your favors, mate. I was looking for an escape plan outside, and there was no way out. I saved two of your friends. I broke into the Pokemon, and I didn't get anything good because I left a berry to a Sendrit. And actually went back to the fucking SSN to get some motherfucking food. And help that boy out. And even had to cut his arm off. I don't know what you are thinking about it. But you all owe me, man. You all owe me, man. I even helped out Lucas with an infected Persian I had to put down. Hey, 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 calm, calm. We know we owe you, man. And we don't want any more favors from you. But. What the fuck? Hey. My dad's calling me, apparently. What? How How is this possible? My father just called me? Hey, Giovanni! Giovanni's trying to make contact with us? Oh, shit. Damn, he hung up after I picked up the phone. This doesn't make no sense. Why shouldn't he call you? He cares about you. <laughs> uh, it's more complicated than you think, man. His actual position is rather Viridian City. And, um, so, you know, he's there. But I thought, he vanished? Is he back? Hey, um, are you okay? Drake? What? <sighs> yeah. I gotta go now. As soon as possible. I can't stay here any longer. Huh? What? I, I don't understand. You don't have to. I have to reach Burina City as soon as possible. This is my real destination. 
If there was any way out. Yeah. But there is none. <sighs> Tigla's cave is blocked. I would never come through. I would never come through. Did I read that right? I don't know. And I can't get over that teared path to Lavender City either. But how about Cerulean City to, or even the Saffron City? You're thinking about a new escape plan? Well, as far as I know, the underground path is administrated by the government of Cerulean City. And it's up to them to open the underground path. But no chance to reach anybody there. I had some date with a girl in Cerulean City. It was near Bill's house, actually. You know, the maniac. But there was a very romantic view of the ocean. Uh, but no success, though. I went home alone without her number. <laughs> Fucking friend zone, man. Yeah, yeah, that's really bad, man. And what about Saffron City? Isn't there any administration that we can reach? Hmm. Yeah, it's not in their hand to open the door between Vermilion and Saffron City. You actually could open the door from there. Uh, but the people from Saffron City might have closed the door. Hmm, but... To switch the open, uh, to switch open the door to Saffron City is still here in Vermilion City, and you wouldn't, you couldn't have mentioned that earlier. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I never thought you would consider this an, es an es escape plan, but you know, because you didn't want to go back to the SSN and whatever, so the main switch is in the power grid of Vermilion City, and the switch is in the gym of Lieutenant Surge, and where is the fucking problem? He can just open the door for us, can't he? At least we could get the hell out of here. And I would be one step closer to Viridian City. Well, there is only one problem. You can't just easily enter the gym. Why not? I'll just uh, jump over the fence and get in. That's it. No, Drake, it's not that easy. Lieutenant Surge only wants the best trainer in his gym. That's why the fence is under high voltage. Jesus Christ. Try to climb over the fence and you will get grilled. Pretty funny that you mentioned the gym with its fence. After you took a visit to the SSN, hmm? what kind of relation does that have? Yeah, uh, I was talking with Lucas about it. Uh, he said he wants to help you no matter what it takes. He seems to like... Uh, okay. Uh, hey, no homo, right? No homo. <laughs> Probably because of the things uh, you recently told him. But I think I have to take a big swing about the gym thing. Uh, the fence of the Pokemon gym has only one weak spot. And it is that weird tree there. The captain of SSN is the master of HMO cut. You could easily cut that tree with that technique. See, that's the problem. We need a key to get in there. But the captain always locks himself in his cabin. So he won't get disturbed by the people. Fortunately, Lucas ah, the, and the captain are members of the same Pokemon club in Vermilion City. Lucas was always there with his Persian until, yeah, well, you know what happened to his fucking Pokemon. But whatever. Uh, the captain stashed his replacement key for his cabin there. And usually, he has the HM101 cut there. So, um, yeah, perhaps he's still alive. Aha! Okay then. How, and how am I supposed to get into the Pokemon club? No problem. Lucas gave me the key. So, he is always so scatty and forgets things. But here you are. Alright, there we go. Good, 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 good. And then, I'll take a look at the Pokemon fan club first. Alright. We will wait for you. Hmm. Of course. What else do you do? You bunch of helpless idiots. <laughs> Alright, cool. Um, you know what? Let's, uh, let's, let's heal up. Let's heal up. Mouse supplies I brought here. Uh, hey, Drake. Hmm. Yeah. Actually, nah. No problem. No problem. Come back to me. Alright. You know, I'm just gonna heal myself up. And that should be enough for the moment. But, um, yeah. Alright. So, um, guys, I'm gonna leave it here for now. I think a uh, fucking one hour worth of gameplay is enough <laughs> for one day. Uh, but yeah, this game is getting really, really interesting. I'm, I'm liking it, man. I'm really liking it. Uh, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed, uh, be sure to leave a like, uh, comment, favorite, subscribe, you know, the whole jazz, rate, comment, subscribe. And uh, stay tuned for more. And as always, I'll smell you guys later. Bye.